ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you what you're in for tonight. We have 10 pleasant newcomers. I've always been very camp. I was um, also only one of my friends at school, right, who felt the need to come in to their parents. I sort of sit down and go, look, Mum, Dad, I've got something to tell you. And it's going to come as quite a shock. I'm not gay. I don't want this to change anything. Mum, we can still go watch Madonna together. My dad was livid, obviously, because he had to give 50 quid to my uncle. So I went to London to be a full-time comedian, and within one month, guys, I'd gone full-time. Thank you. You were right to be hesitant because it was in boots, but still, a job's a job. I'm from uh, Northern Ireland. I'm from a place called Ballybeg. <laughs> it's, a, it's a village about, in Northern Ireland about a, an hour from the coast if you've got a, a really fast horse. <laughs> but like an hour, 10, hour, 15 on a normal horse. Uh, if you got a car, it's like 20 minutes, it's just down the road. <laughs> From here, actually, it's not that far. As the crow flies, you're talking between 400 and 24,000 miles, depending on which direction the crow flies off in. <laughs> OJ Simpson is my favorite black actor. It's not so much the stuff he did in the Naked Gun films or in Towering Inferno. It's in that nine-month TV court drama that he was in. I thought, oh my God, this man is amazing. That really slow car chase right at the beginning was excellent to watch. So was the moment in the courtroom when he tried to stick his hand in that glove and it didn't fit and he just had a massive smile on his face. And I thought to myself, isn't it nice seeing somebody enjoy their work? Guys, I realise that last joke is reliant on the audience being maybe made up of people roughly my age or from my social bubble. Uh, so if you didn't get it and you feel excluded, rest assured, I'm going to do my best to make the rest of the set accessible for all, including the older generation. Uh, which I think is really nice of me, considering it's not something you did for our generation with regards to the housing market and the general economy. <laughs> I'm an atheist now, but I was actually raised a sassy Catholic. I don't know if it's the Catholic thing or if it's the Scottish blood, but in my family, we're bad at expressing emotions. And I've looked at myself and tried to work out what's the problem. And I think on reflection, the reason I'm bad at expressing emotions is I don't have eyebrows on my face. And, well, it's hard to express emotions without the necessary facial equipment. Yeah, that is what's wrong with his face, yeah. Yeah, now I didn't see it before and now I can't not see it. It's like someone put a wig on an egg. I know. When I get depressed, I don't cry. No. These tears, these eyes, dry as a bone. Because I like to push the tears down and push them down and let them build and build and build until I'm about to blow. And then I step into an art museum and I just let it rip. Because I like to make the other people in the museum think that I just get the art more than they do. Because if I'm going to suffer, I might as well feel culturally superior and highly sophisticated while doing so. I did a gig a few months back, and as soon as I walked on stage, a lady in the audience it just yelled out, Ching Chong! It's cool, though, because I took it in, thought about it, came to the conclusion that it's fine if she does that. Because uh, while she's doing that, we're taking over. You guys won't be laughing when you're living in England town. No, you're Brexiting, but that's basically what we're gonna call all of Europe. We're not gonna differentiate between you guys. You all look the same to us. And now you understand why we photograph so much. Inventory. No man should look cool putting on a condom. Do you ever get into a bedroom situation with a guy and he's like, oh, what's that behind your ear? Oh. For moi? Get the fuck out of there. I'll tell you how I know we're getting too PC, right? We now have racial emojis. Remember when all emojis were yellow? 
I'll tell you why I don't like these new racial emojis. Because I had no idea what shade of black I was until these new emojis came out, but apparently I am second to last black. 